good morning y'all good morning good morning good morning and welcome back to my channel it's your girl asia if you're new to see my face welcome my name is asia mckell i'm august leo if you're feeling me messing with my vibe make sure you watch to the end of the video subscribe on your way out if you're not new to see my face welcome back to my channel what's good what's tea what's popping what's up boo what's tea what's going on yes meal welcome back to my channel so as you can tell it's kind of bright and early Y'all can hear Ace in the background. It is currently 8.37 in the morning. And we're about to do a little day in the life vlog. So, yeah, let's get into it. Y'all already know I work from home, so I'm currently working. So, I'm going to just show y'all a little bit of what I do on my day as I work from home. So, make sure y'all stay tuned to the end. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Turn the bell on the side to be notified every time I post. So, you don't miss a beat, baby. Yes, ma'am. I'm about to hop straight into this video because y'all know I can talk and it's early in the morning and I don't really feel like talking right now. So, <laughs> I'm not a morning person, y'all. So, just watch to the video. I got to take Ace out and work clean, all that good stuff. Because yesterday was just hectic, but... Yeah, we're about to get into it, so say so. I already did go ahead and wash my face for today, y'all. And I already brushed my teeth, so I already had got that stuff out of the way. If y'all want a skincare routine, let me know in the comments and I got y'all. Ignore the pimple in the middle of my forehead. I just woke up to this, so I'm sorry, y'all. I gotta get A settled because he's acting crazy right now, so I need to take him out and we need to go be him and lock him. So that's what we got to do. Cause he wants to be a crybaby. Let me turn the lights on in here. Ace. Say hello to your internet aunties and uncles. Say hello. You say hello? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? It's so cold outside, y'all. I got my robe on, a jacket on, <laughs> pants on, and he just ready to see the bathroom. No, come on, keep going. Thank you. Mommy is on crunch time. She is working. You know, you only have a little bit of time to work with when we come out here. You always gotta be extra and pee on the side of the sidewalk. Like, why you just can't? All this, all this grass, all this grass, Ace. Come on. So, <clears throat> this is how I fix his food. He already had people in here from last night, and I just put an egg in here. So, let me just show y'all. I don't know if y'all can see or not. And I just. Crack the egg. I can't do too much like I want to. Usually I stir it up. But... He gonna eat it without us. Come on. That's the first thing he go for every time. So the only reason why the quality looks a little bit better is because I'm filming on my back camera and I'm not really too much liking it a lot because I can't really see myself. But my front camera is broke, it's cracked, so I can't really film on my front camera like that. I work, cause you already know I do chat at my job. So when I'm not looking at the camera, I'm looking at my computer screen. So not to try to throw y'all off or anything. But I gotta tell y'all something. TikTok Shop sent me this plumper, the viral plumper that was going around on TikTok Shop. This junk, this junk right here, is the truth. Let me open it up and show y'all what it was like. And it's so cute because it actually looks like a, a syringe. But let me just tell y'all my experience with this because I did try it out the day before yesterday. Um, oh, okay, there we go. Oh, okay. Clumsy. But this is what she's giving. Yes, ma'am. And let me tell y'all something. This this ain't nothing to play with. It got chili extract. I've never tried any even plumper like this one itself. Like the sting, the burning, 
it feels like you actually getting your lips done that's literally how it feel like now people were saying leave it on for 10 minutes baby i did i couldn't even leave it on for more than two minutes that's how bad it was like i had to wipe that junk off it actually works it definitely works but my lips were suffering boo suffering they were burning on fire even after i wiped it off and put some vaseline over it even if vaseline was burning i was like damn what y'all put up in there because I just, I just came out of lips felt like it was on fire. It felt like it was going to fall off. And my best friend talking about something. Oh, you being dramatic? You being dramatic? Girl, I'm not being dramatic. How you going to tell me what I'm feeling and how I feel, girl? This junk, it hurts. I know I could be a dramatic person, but that I'm not being dramatic about. That junk burns. Oh, yeah, I did invest into a ring light, y'all. Let me show y'all what it looked like. I got it from Ross. I'm sorry that I vlogged that. It was just like a last minute decision, but I got this ring light because it's the only one that I could get in a short amount of time. So let me just show y'all. Let me turn the flash off, hold on. See, this is what the ring light looks. It is a little bit childish, but it's also kind of cute because it's a Disney edition ring light. So it's shaped like the Mickey Mouse logo and it has Mickey Mouse right here, but it's real cute, y'all. It's real simple and it's giving what it's supposed to give. It does the job and this is what my front camera is looking like, y'all. I don't know why it's giving, like, 3D. They give y'all 3D. Who y'all know give me y'all 3D quality? But me. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, that's why I'm not filming on my front camera because it's giving 3D, boo. I don't know what's going on, sis. Who is that? <laughs> but, yeah. That's the little ring light that I got from Ross. And I only spent $9 on that ring light. The other one that I wanted, it was like just a regular old circle ring light and it was $10, but it didn't have that one. I should have got it when I was there. But y'all gonna see me in a few like get ready to get changed and stuff like that. And we're gonna like clean up the house. I gotta show y'all these three wigs that Sheen sent me that I have to get done at a before a certain date. So we gotta figure out what we're gonna do with those wigs too, sis. Cause I don't know. And yes, those wigs will be added onto the website. They will be added to the wig collection that we use my reused wig collection so don't worry after i wear them and post the video that she want me to do then i will add those wigs to my websites but y'all gotta stay tuned for that if y'all interested in becoming a wig influencer and wanting to start your wig influencer journey then your first step is to get my ebook my step-by-step -step guide that is on my website it will teach you on how to become a wig influencer but beginner friendly of how i started now it is other levels to it which i do put in that ebook but i didn't put too much information because i do plan on making an ebook part two on the next level like intermediate level if y'all if that makes sense so make sure you guys check that out it's only 15 dollars. i do plan on launching the sale around black friday so make sure y'all stay tuned for that i was going to put me some breakfast but i'm not really a breakfast eater and my man since he home he don't leave for work and so a little bit and i already asked him if he want breakfast and he said that he didn't want any breakfast so if y'all see any in the future that i don't really cook breakfast like that's because we're not breakfast eaters so i'm going to put that out there so y'all remember i told y'all a few moments ago that she has sent me three weeks to do let me just show y'all the three weeks okay so this is the first one let me back up this is the first one. Lace is giving what it's supposed to give. Yes, ma'am. I already tried my best to pluck them. This one is 26 inches and it's straight. Yes, ma'am. Body, body. Get into it. Um, this next one is a deep wave burgundy wig. Lace. Get into it. It's a little hole in there because I was I was using the little needles to hold it into the mannequin head, but y'all already know that piece gonna get cut off. But this is how she looking. I just got her in a ponytail because y'all already know how curly hair gets. It get matted and tangled real fast, so I needed to put it in a ponytail. And the other one that I just got sent, let me get it for you. This is the other one. This one came with baby hairs. Now, one of these will be my personal wig, so only two of these are gonna be added to the website. They were supposed to send me another one, but I'm not sure what happened to that. But one of these, I believe it's going to be the other straight wig because this one, I mean, I like it, but it's not that one. So this one and this one will be added to the website. So I'll, that'll be four to five wigs that I have available for sale on my website real soon. So make sure I just stay tuned for that. This one I'm going to be using as my personal everyday wig because I just need to have maybe at least one wig as a backup wig. One or two wigs as a backup wig. 
my next wig is gonna be a curly wig as a backup wig. So I'm gonna have a straight one and a curly one. Just if I wanna switch it up, you know, switch it up. Switch my wig, make her feel like he cheating. What Max said? <laughs> I need the five. I need the five. Anywho. And let me just get this out of the way because I really feel bad. So let me just give y'all a little quick story time real quick. This is a little story time. So my true supporters, if y'all entered into the first big giveaway, then y'all already know what was going on. So the first big giveaway, this one girl, I'm not going to name her name, but she know exactly who I am talking about because <laughs> I'm sorry, sis, I'm just sorry. But anyways, the first big giveaway, the girl that won the first wig from one the first time, she didn't respond back in the amount of time that I gave. I gave everybody like a set time frame to DM me um, to collect their free wig, but she didn't respond back until the next day. And I didn't take in consideration that I actually have other people outside of the U.S. and other countries that actually watch me. And the girl that actually won the giveaway, she was all the way in Jamaica and she didn't get to respond back till the next day. So I, I thought about it and I t talked it over with my man and, you know, I just feel like it was not fair enough because you know the times are different so i reached out to her and i was like hey girl i still send you either these three bundles or i could send you another wig i apologize i did not take that in consideration i did send the other girl her wig and she did get her get that wig if i can find the dm in the post i can put it in the video but with the other girl it's been like two or three months, maybe even a little bit longer. And I really feel embarrassed by saying this, but I do just want to take accountability. Like, I do apologize for taking so long with sending out your wig. I do apologize. It really isn't like me. And I really, really apologize, girl. I really hope you accept my apology. But y'all got to understand that this is my everyday real life. And I am being open honest with y'all. I don't get paid off of YouTube yet. And I don't get paid off of TikTok at all. So the money that I use to get back to my supporters and me taking the time to go ship off the wig and stuff like that i'm using my heart on working money and this is expensive you girl every time she turn around every time she blink is rent every time she breathe in it's another bill that's due you feel me <laughs> like so that's that's so that's another reason why i said why i wasn't able to send out that wig it's because bill's got the best of me so just give me uh just give me some time and i'm gonna get that wig sent out to you i promise girl i have not forgot about you another reason is i'm running off one car right now so we doing we working with what god is giving us in the exact moment and we're being grateful for the things that he's given us right now so we can be even more grateful for the things that he's going to bless us in the future which is more abundance and more blessings so i'm trying to be grateful and i'm trying to be patient with the things that i have currently so we only working with one car right now and i have to wait really a lot of the times for my men to get off of work and by the time my men get off of work the place is closed so i have to wait either on the weekends to go or wait until his schedule changes again so that's another reason why i haven't been able to get that wig out but as soon as i can girl i will send that wig out and i do apologize i really do so i hope you accept my apology and i love you and i appreciate you for keeping keeping me up on that um keeping me up on it because honestly i did forget at one point so i do honestly apologize and i hope you accept my apology girl i love you but anyway y'all we about to get myself together because i look a hot mess i did my retwist yesterday my best friend was supposed to come down saturday but she ended up not because she was having some car troubles so she was supposed to do my retwist for me but i ended up doing it myself uh either the next day no i know yeah i ended up doing it the same day saturday night it only took me like an hour and a half and my retwists are actually getting a lot better y'all they're getting a whole lot better and i'm really excited of how this journey and this process is turning out my hair is growing a lot y'all a lot i'm gonna insert like a clip of what my hair is like when i first started off but my hair is growing extremely a lot from when i first started shake your day shake your day shake your day <laughs> only thing that i use on my hair for my waist twist is blue magic that's all i don't use no beeswax because it dries out my scalp i try not to use any other products because i'm really really strictly hesitant of what i put on my scalp because my psoriasis will flare up over anything it will flare up even off of water oh yeah we went to his mom's his mom house yesterday because it was our birthday so we went over there to celebrate her birthday whatever and she loves me she spoils me so i'm very much spoiled over there I'm very much spoiled i saw her i ran out of essential oils because i have the essential oil diffuser in the bathroom i saw her i ran out of it and look what she gave a whole 
whole thing in that central oil. And she gave me, and she gave me a um, black Letterman jacket. Here you with a hoodie on it, and it fits perfectly. And I'm gonna be wearing the heck out of it. Thank you, Miss Anna. But nothing happening right now. I'm about to do these little bit of chats and stuff. I don't really start cleaning up and stuff around you know 12 o'clock and it's 9 26 in the morning so i'm about to chillax relax watch a couple of different tiktoks and see how i'm gonna plan these wigs out and all this good stuff so i'm gonna hit y'all up once i get ready to start doing my daily things for today and yes i'm gonna be cooking in this video so this may be a little bit of a long vlog so you're welcome i'll talk to y'all in a minute i'll be right back I'll call right back. I'll be back, y'all. So, y'all remember when I told y'all we weren't no breakfast eaters? Why this man hungry? So, I gotta cook him some eat. Period. So, um, he, I'm gonna make me a little bit of grits. He don't like grits. So, I'm gonna make me like a little pot of grits. And I'm going to make him like a breakfast sandwich or something. Because that's usually what he eats for breakfast. If he do eat breakfast. And I'm just going to show y'all how I do, what I do, and when I do it. Okay. Let me face the camera. Period. I need to get out this robe. But this is a little OOTD of the day. This is what I wear all the time throughout the day. Just wear night clothes. You feel me? Throughout the whole day, baby. We do not get dressed to be working at home. That's just me personally. I Don't get me wrong. I dress sometimes. I get dressed to be cute or if I'm filming like a TikTok video, but that's the only time. Gotta get the eggs. We put them in this book container because we be buying a big bulk of eggs and we don't be wanting that big old box in the refrigerator. So we put our eggs in the container. Yeah. Gotta get the bacon. I man say he hungry. That means for me to get my ass up and go kick him something to eat because he be hungry. Vlogmas is coming up. Should I participate in Vlogmas while well, I drop a video every day of the month in December? Should I? I wanted to participate in Vlogmas last year, but I couldn't. This is what he do. Say hey to the vlog, babe. Ooh. He don't like being on camera like that, but... This is all the stuff, all the stuff that I need to put up that we went through yesterday. Yeah, Ace didn't eat all his food this morning, but all this stuff I have to put away because I was going to do my best friend feet whenever she got here, but she ended up not coming. So I did finish breakfast just that fast. I'm going to go ahead and just straighten up really quickly while I unload the dishwasher. Some of the dishes didn't wash fully, so I need to keep them in here so they can be washed. So I'm going to just take out the ones that are already clean.
finish eating, I'm gonna put our dishes in the dishwasher and I'm gonna start. Okay, so y'all already know I use my phone to film. It is on 10%, so I'm about to let it charge for a little bit. And I'm about to sit down and work because I got some chats to complete. I take my lunch in about 15 minutes. So I'm going to show y'all what the food look like once I get on, my, get on my lunch break. And finish up a couple different things on my lunch break after I finish eating. So I'm going to get back to y'all after I let my phone fully charge. Well, at least to get to a certain percentage where I could be able to use it without having it attached to a charger so let me sit down let me do some work and be productive and then i'll be back to y'all okay boom so i got my grits eggs and bacon and some cheese and he got a breakfast sandwich right here and you already know i'm about to take my lunch break and we about to chow down because i'm hungry and this look good so period you all clean I'm gonna take that as a yes. All right, so we're about to go ahead and switch over to the voiceover. We did go ahead and watch Ace, but I did not get no video clips of that. And that's because Ace getting older and he getting well more aware of things, I can say. And he know when it's bath time. So he try not to go in our room. So he'll go in our room any other time. But when he know, like when he see his shampoo and all his other tools that we use to wash him get pulled out and transferred to the bathroom, then he know what time it is. So he was struggling trying to get Ace in the bathroom. And Ace is getting a lot bigger and a lot chunkier too. So <laughs> he be having a hard time trying to get Ace in that tub. But we're going to get to the point where eventually we'll be able to be blessed to be able to move into a house to where we could be able to you know just wash him outside but for right now we wash him in the tub and yes we do thoroughly clean out the tub after we get done washing him i make sure that 100 percent because baby i don't play like that okay <laughs> And I know I could take him to like Tractor Supply or like PetSmart or somewhere to get him washed. But it's just a simple thing is we ball on the budget, baby. We trying to save a little bit of coin over here. Like I just told y'all, we're trying to wait on God to bless us to be able to move into a house. So <laughs> every little coin that we can save, we trying to save. So we could wash him in a tub and just wash it off afterwards. That's what we're going to do, sis, okay? But as you can tell here, I'm just finishing up the kitchen. I'm just cleaning up here, just sleeping and mopping, finishing up some things. Going ahead and put all this stuff away all this stuff oh that little trick that i showed y'all before with the pot of water on the stove that y'all see in the back it's a little pot of water and y'all see that i put essential oils inside of it that helps eliminate i mean eliminates a lot of like smells in the house like because y'all know i deal with a lot of smells with ace because he's a puppy so you know animals comes with smells so i be fighting like i be fighting the smells in the house and y'all already know i'm in a small space so you know everything is just clammed up in one area so when you first walk into my house you smell an ace and I don't want people to just walk in and just smell a so I just took it upon myself and put essential oils and water on the stove because I don't have a diffuser for the living room kitchen area yet I only have them for the bathroom and my room so that's what we're currently working on I am going to be doing more apartment hauls and affordable apartment shopping videos because I am planning on buying a whole bunch of stuff for our next place so we don't have to do a whole bunch of shopping when that time do come
And that's really the solely reason why I don't post apartment haul or apartment shopping videos anymore because we're running out of space. We're literally cramped in here and it's no need for me to go out shopping and buying a whole bunch of stuff and I don't have nowhere to put it. Like literally we have clothes sitting in our closet floor because we can't hang them up and we, they cannot fit in the dressers. We got majority of our shoes up under the bed. We got sh extra sheets and blankets under the bed. Like y'all, we're literally, literally running out of space in here. So I'm just patiently waiting. We're both patiently waiting for God to just bless us with something that we're comfortable with and that we'll actually love and hopefully it'll be a house and not another apartment because baby I can't do these apartments no more they do too much it's too expensive and if I'm paying all this rent in a one bedroom apartment baby I might as well get me a house because who about to be paying dang near $1,100 for a 600 square feet one bedroom apartment calling it quote-unquote luxury baby ain't nothing luxury about this we did end up going to the grocery store because we're prepping early for Thanksgiving since we are doing our own Thanksgiving dinner together as our small family this year. Just me, him, and Ace. And then hopefully we have like some of our siblings come grab a plate, come chill with us. But we'll see. So this is what we're doing, a little concoction to try to get Ace to eat because he act like he getting bored with his food. So we have to cut up some veggies, some celery, carrots, squash, cucumbers. We do put coconut oil in his food. Sometimes we put an egg in there here in there this is him trying out the veggies to see if he liking them he wasn't really feeling it like that so we did end up boiling the veggies after we cut them down so that he can be able to chew them um better because i feel like they were just not chewable for him they're too hard but he did eventually eat his food as y'all can see he did have chicken gizzards uh, of course the veggies that i just named coconut oil and his kibble that he have on a regular day basis and i did finish dinner because i did cook chicken alfredo that night Something quick because I do try to cook early now that my man's schedule has changed. But of course, you already know we have to show Ace a little bit of love and we do wipe him down every single night. Well, at least we try to, especially after he get a bath, just to eliminate that wet dog smell and the Frito smell as well. Because you know, pit bulls they can um, accumulate fungus between their paws and it can cause them to smell like a bag of Fritos, a bag of old stale Doritos, and that's exactly what he smell like. But <laughs> Ace don't be messing around with me. Like like that he love me though he do know that i'm his mommy and that he he do listen to me but he listens to his dad more he definitely listens to bay more they call him a velcro probably because he only wants to eat and do certain things when bay is there when he's not there he don't want to eat he don't want to interact he don't want to be active so forth so forth but y'all get to see we're trying to work on it i i be trying to train him but it doesn't it don't be helping it don't be working but i still love him at the end of the day he's still my boo boo so y'all it is literally like two days later and i did not film an outro so i do apologize i hope y'all all watched to the end of this video if you did give it a big old thumbs up hit that subscribe button on your way out turn on the bell on the side to be notified every time i post it don't miss a beat baby make sure y'all go follow my tiktok at asia mikhail and make sure y'all go check out my description box because that's where i leave a bunch of my information at down below if y'all like this day in the life vlog i will have more coming this is just a little simple day in my life literally i do the same thing literally every day so i mean i don't want to bore y'all with a lot of day in the life vlogs for me working from home and i do the same thing every single day if that makes sense so i'm gonna be doing them still but i'm not gonna do it as frequent because i want to be able to keep y'all entertained and i don't want to bore y'all with the same old vlog all the time you feel me but i do have more juicy content coming soon i have like a couple different juicy story times and all that so make sure y'all stay tuned for that don't miss out we are on the road for 2k 2k subscribers and we are doing another wig giveaway and a 50 dollar money um gift card giveaway as well so make sure y'all stay tuned and subscribe and share my videos out to your homegirls yes ma'am and i'm gonna see y'all in the next video bye